Hey everybody, how's it going? Jonathan here with Automate with Jonathan. In this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, install the Chrome driver as of today in October 2022. So in order to install the Chrome driver, we need to know which Chrome driver to, to install because there's, there's like over a hundred different versions and the version needs to correspond to uh, the version of Chrome that you have installed. So, and Chrome updates itself periodically. So you're probably gonna go out of date and need to update this, this uh, file. So how do we find our version of Chrome? It's the first question we've got to ask. Well, to do that, we go open up Chrome, we click these three dots, and then we go to help and then we go to about Google Chrome and that's going to tell us right here in about Google Chrome, it's gonna say version 105. So we're version 105. What do we do with this information? Well, we need to go to the Chrome driver downloads page. How do you get here? You, you go to this link. This link is in the description of this video. So we're gonna use the information we just gathered, the 105, version 105 rather, and we're gonna go down to Chrome version 105. We click it. And on this page, oh, I might have to reload it. On this page, there will be four uh, Chrome versions. Pick the one that corresponds with your computer. If you've got a newer Mac, it's, you use the M1 chip. If you have a uh, Mac 64 like I do, just click that one. And there you go. Now you've downloaded the Chrome driver for your Mac. So. Once it's downloaded, we have to put it somewhere. The truth is, I think we can just put it anywhere. However, I have mine here in user local bin Chrome driver. So we go into user local bin Chrome driver to access this folder. What we do is we press the Windows key, Shift and K, or no, I'm sorry, G. <laughs> Windows key, Shift and G, Windows key, Shift G, or Apple key, Shift G. And that'll open up user local bin. So let's do it again. Apple key shift G. And then you have to type in here slash user slash local slash bin. And then we drag over the Chrome driver that we just downloaded and extracted and put it in that folder. Now, from there, we should be able to run our, uh, our Selenium and Python experiments or tests. But the problem is that that's a new uh, piece of software. There's going to be some some OS Mac OS uh, safeguards that are going to prevent you from opening it. So how do you get around that? You go into settings and you click here security and privacy, and it's going to know we just tried to open it but got blocked. And we just go in there and click allow anyway. And now we should run it. It's going to ask us if we're sure to open it. It'll only do this once, and then it should run the software or whatever script we just created. So there you go. This script opens up Google Chrome, and there you have it. Thank you so much for watching. If you got anything out of this video, please hit the subscribe button, uh, and then and the link to the Chrome driver is uh, is in the the description below. So thank you. Click that link for the Chrome driver, and also. Be sure to subscribe. Thanks.